I don't even know how to start this video. This is hard. This has got to be the hardest video that we've ever made. Harder than that 17 hour labor video? Yeah, that was pretty easy. That was an easy video. This one's even harder than that. Everyone thinks that our life is perfect. Everybody thinks that I'm the perfect dad. No, they don't. Well, I mean, a lot of your friends think that I'm a really good dad, though. Uh, no, they don't. This just sucks. Doing this video sucks huge balls. Like golf balls? No, huge balls. Like, bigger than that. Bigger than golf balls. Like baseballs? No, bigger than... Huge balls. Bigger than baseballs. Like beach balls? No, not like a beach ball. Like, it not that big. Like a um, volleyball. Yeah, like a volleyball. It sucks like a like a volleyball size ball, like the regulation volleyball size balls. Like it sucks one of those size balls. People don't realize that a lot of things go on in our life behind the camera. People don't even realize that there's a lot of things that happen that we don't put on YouTube. This is hard. I don't even want to make this video. I seriously don't even want to make it. I would rather just not make this video. I don't even want to make it. You already said that, Dad. Well, I know. I'm just, I was just repeating myself for emphasis. It sounds like you're just rambling on and on and just saying stuff that doesn't need to be said. I know, but not like, not everything said needs to be said. It's just tough because we vlog every day. Like seriously, we seriously vlog every single day that we feel like it. And we've been vlogging for, for like a year. Oh, a little over a year, Dad, like a year and a half. Can you stop correcting me? How many times do I have to tell you when the camera's on not to interrupt me or correct me? I feel stupid. I feel so stupid making this video. Yeah. You feel stupid too? No. I just feel like a lot of it's for show. We do these funny videos or we go out and vlog and I do something fun with my daughter and I find myself asking myself, Am I doing this because I love her or just for YouTube? Like the other day when I took you out to lunch and I'm watching you eat and I'm sitting there, I'm thinking, am I feeding her because I love my daughter or am I just feeding you for the video? That's where I've been. That's where I'm at right now. Doing a YouTube video every single day that you feel like it can put a lot of stress on a father-daughter relationship. It's not just me. Every single father and daughter that I know that vlogs feels the same way. Every single one. The name one. I know, like seriously, I could I could name off a whole list no, of names. Of, name one. I mean like um like George and Georgina. They you know? Don't Those people don't exist. I mean I mean George I mean George and Elaine. You mean the people from Seinfeld? Look, I don't want to name names, that's not fair for me. I don't want to call out people and name names. That's not, I don't want to do that to them. But everybody, everyone that I know that is a father and a daughter that makes videos, they feel the same way I do. I tell this to people all the time. When people come up to me and ask me advice for vlogging, I say don't do it. If you're a dad, don't do it. Do not do daily videos with your kids. They will embarrass you, they will mess up, and you'll be up editing every night till two in the morning. We just need a break. I need a break. I just need to stop. I can tell you, I, I let me put it this way. When being a dad starts to feel like a job, it's, it's toxic for everybody. Yeah. Do you agree? Yeah. Can you speak so that camera can hear you? How many times do I have to tell you the camera has to pick up your voice? 